as we know a website is nothing but a collection of interlinked web pages so using hyperlink also you can actually navigate from one page of a website to another but if programmatically it is required like after a particular operation you want to go to some other page for example as soon as you submitted your form you want to go to an another page which will give you confirmation like your data has been saved so in any such scenarios you can actually go for the page redirect in javascript and here we have a method of windows object called location and inside this location method you can actually pass a string parameter which will be a url of a particular location where you want to go so on a particular event like button click as soon as this method will get called your page will be redirect to that particular location so let's see practically how this window dot location works and what are their different parameters and overloadings available so in this particular program i am simply changing the location of one page to the another page so in this particular page what i am doing is i have simply placed a button with the text redirect me and when you will click this will call the redirect function and inside this redirect function what i have done is i have simply called this window dot location property it will simply change the location of your page and whatever page you have specified will be shown to the user so when i'll execute this you can see i am here in the tutorials point website i can also do that on a particular timeout basis as you may have seen like when you get a particular page you will be shown some ads and after that particular time after some particular time like maybe 5 seconds 10 seconds the actual site is there means it will automatically redirect you to the actual website after that advertisement so i can do that as well so for that i don't need this button uh, i'll remove this text or i'll write something like uh, you will be redirected in 5 seconds all right and what i'll do is i'll call this function on the load method like on load i'll not call it directly i'll call the time out function which will actually do the trick basically this time out function will call this redirect function redirect all right and uh, let's put them in single quotations as i already have a double quotes all right and now uh i'll do that after 5000 milliseconds so this particular redirect function will be called on the load after 5000 milliseconds because as soon as the body will get loaded it will call this timeout function and this timeout will give a call back to this redirect function after 5 seconds so let's refresh the page so this is the message which i have passed here all right so it's not there let me check the code all right actually there is some uh, set timeout function is there rather than this timeout uh, this is there is a set timeout function which will do that particular task which i was just talking about now i'll call this set timeout and let's refresh this page again so maybe after 5 seconds i'll be redirected and yes as you can see now i'm here in this tutorials point website again so this is how you can implement the page redirection while using the javascript